start off <coughs> hello welcome and um, i'm going to start off with something completely different as they say in sense that as it says word wars and creation kit and there's a couple of things i want to change about um how the game is going at difficulty and something else so um yeah so let's have a look and see what i want what i want to change i'll have a look hang on <laughs> It's a bit busy. Here we go. Nexus Mod Manager. What I have to do first is find the mod that I want to edit. It's my mod. I got one. I made it just for me for this playthrough. Um, <clears throat> one or two. One of them affects my follower. It's just like make sure she levels up properly and change her skills a bit. No, it's Thord Ariana, that's it. So let's have a look at that one first. Um, I think I saw it there, just, there it is. So I just select it in here. I'm not going to tell you how to work this. If you want to know how to work, work this, search um, one word, Thord TV, mods, plural, M-O-D-S, that one. I think that's the one. It's a second channel anyway, but it just tells you how to install it. And it's loads of stuff. You can have a look at uh, Dark Fox. He will. That's where I've learned everything for, to do with modding. But uh, for now, I'm just going to go through. I'm just going to do the mod. I mean, you, you can see it then. I, sh I might show you a um, quick look. At, this is this is the game as is full of bugs. So you just ignore that. It really doesn't matter. The game is full and it won't affect me or anybody else while I'm in the modding. Mods are not bugged. That's the important thing. So Ford Ariana. Okay, I'm going to do it in her. I'll keep it in her mod, I think. Hmm. But I, I, like I said, it's just for me. I can't remember what I edited, what I changed. But yeah, just for me. Um, I want... <clears throat> she keeps summoning <clears throat> the Fire Atronach. The thing is, um, it when I'm sneaking, it knows I'm. It's it sees me, and I get it, it's affecting the you know the, the cursor in the middle of the screen. The eye shows up as if somebody can see me. Well, the person that can see me is that one, but I want to know if the enemy can see me, not that one. You have to choose. I mean, you can have both, I suppose. Um, so that's what I'm editing. I just need to see. It should be like a tick in a box or something. I'll have a look. I don't know. See, the follower doesn't. The follower doesn't. Doesn't. Um, doesn't. Uh, obviously, doesn't. Doesn't see me when I crouch. The follower doesn't affect my crouch state. This takes ages to open. Doesn't it? <laughs> hey. Oh uh, well. Um. What have I got running? Oh, is she? Is it's this one? Ar Arania? Ina? Ina? Oh, there's another more bugs. Uh, it's just loading the games, all the games, or the game and the expansions one at a time. She's the priestess of Azura. When you go to the shrine of Azura and you do stuff, when when you do every done everything, it's finished and and um, uh, she has nowhere to go, so she can be a follower. Uh, now I just sort of thought, well, I'll take it with me. I felt awful. I done. I like finished off. You know, the, um, Azura was happy, and, thought, and then she didn't have to go. She didn't have a job. <laughs> My fault. Oh blummy! I must admit, I knew it would take ages, but I mean, this is just one of a couple of mods that I've got to change. So, um, and it's not the size of the mod. It's that they've been, well. Crazy, isn't it? I can you imagine you're making a mod and then you, you, you find a mistake, so you want to close the mod and open it again? You can't, you've got to do this every time. <laughs> Look, it's all about like dialogue is bugged, um, dialogue is bugged, lots of it, loads of it. But that's done anyway. Yeah, oh, there it is. There, look, there, there's that's all the bugs I said yes to, or multiple next idols. Farmer, multiple next idols for idol form enter table. I don't know what that's all about. Anyway, um, Ariana. So probably 
she's got a re hang on, uh, oh I didn't type quickly I forgot that now it's going to go all the way through the list find everything beginning with a r and then a r oh it stopped at that Ariana um it's been a while <laughs> uh flipping it up by type here we go type uh if i look down here i can't see her where is she where's the npc i mean oh great this is going well isn't it <sighs> she might not she might not be called that in the thing this might tell me actually some of them do uh she's known as it's a reference id but that's no good oh for goodness sake faction azura i can search the faction for her if i can find it <clears throat> Oh, get over here. Form type. Uh, maybe that uh, trigger. Apparently, has been so a look. There's books. It's a book. <laughs> yeah, that's what a book looks like. You've got um, locations, lights, a auto message. She might even come up in here as as uh, voice of a female. I can't see a faction, an Azura faction. Okay, actor. There's the voice. What was she called? Aliana or something? Uh, oh, it's A R. Um, Arania. Maybe I did that wrong. Around it. There she is. She's up there. And she's a little star next to the one. That means I've edited her. So if I go in. There she is. Cancel that. There she is. So I don't know what I changed. Probably something to do with her. There, it doesn't affect stealth me, TC. So that's her. Alright. And then I can see her spells. There's her spells. Oh, she can use loads of them in there. She probably shouldn't have that many. Was her max level? That might have been. I might have changed that to possible. Weight, distance, stats. Is it? It's been so long. Here, look. Max level ninety nine. I'll probably change that. But anyway, so she's using look. Atronac. Where was it? She uses it every flipping time. Conjure flame out shot. And I don't, maybe. Hmm. It's probably better to remove it because what she's doing. Um, I can edit the Atronach. Um, but if I tick it to say that it doesn't affect stealth and somebody else summons it and sees me I won't know so yeah let's just, just remove that and what has she got instead what could, what could she I, I could make a copy of the Atronach uh, a unique to her so she summons her own Atronach and only she summons that one and that one maybe that one won't affect me but I, I think the best thing is just to to make sure she can't summon anything. She's um she's not a summoner. She's a element she's elemental mage, but so whatever. Uh where has it gone? Spell list. So yeah, let's just take that out. There we go. So she got Icy Spear, Ice Spike, Ice Storm, Chain Lightning. Chain that's the one she keeps using, Chain Lightning. Uh, lightning bolt, right, and thunderbolt, right, I don't know. I mean, look, 343 mana, she'll never use that. I need to change these. She's using, like, two, I don't need, want her to use so many uh, here. And maybe re remove some of the, you know. These are her perks. 
shock, frost, regeneration, recovery, light foot. So she steps on the trap, she won't set it off. It's a bit of an obvious one. So that is it's hardly worth having there, is it? She she's gonna use up all her mana just just casting that one or that one if she casts it. And then she'll be stuck with this one or or this one. Ward is his handy. Fast healing. Close wounds is is to heal me, isn't it? Close wounds. Maybe I should just give her fast healing and nothing else. I don't know. A little bit. Um, so all these ice things are really nice. I like the lightning. The lightning. Um, if she hits something with lightning, it loses mana. Magicka. So maybe I can just delete this one. If she wants to use a bit of ice spike, she can. But then she'd be leaning more towards uh, lightning. Uh, I like that. I like her thought of her using that stone flesh, oak flesh. Why has she got that? Both of those. She doesn't need both. Let's change this a bit. Look. I'll take out stone flesh. Icy. There, yeah, now she's not gonna, now she's gonna be a bit more balanced with the, the skills, the, the spells that she uses. That do. There. Yes, tall. I should really have backed it up. What is this? What? Female head? Uh, I don't know what that is, but um, never mind. We're just. <laughs> It's saved, so that's that's the important thing. So I can't I don't think there is a file closed look. It's only exit. And then I've got to start it again. I wanna change the difficulty. The what it is, what I wanna change, the bandits are running away. And I don't want them to run away ever. Okay, now I don't know which mod I changed it in. It's probably in Thord something. Can I sort by now? I can't sort by now. Right, let's start at Thord Greens. It's probably in Thord Greens. Oh wait, there's one Thord mob mob leveler or something, was it? Simply Stronger Dragons. I saw it. Simple Thord uh, no. God. Travelers. Oh, it's Smith all. That's complete smithing. Laundry. Birds of Skyrim. Um, there's the Smith light. There's the other one. So yeah, I'd have to edit both if I if I wanted to do. Um. Change the Xbox One and it takes ages. It really forever. Um, <clears throat> time. There's the cloud storage. Ragnar Castle is enabled. I didn't know that. I thought it wasn't. Um, Moira. I I can't even remember who that is. Anyway, no, it's bored. It is in Sword Bernice PlayStation 4. Hmm. Oh, why have I got there? Oh, maybe, oh well, whatever. Um, it's a follower. I don't use her anymore, but you can't just, you know, ignore them. You can't remove the mod. That'll mess up the game most of the lot often. It's the resurrection one, but I don't know. I can't find the skill. <laughs> This stops, um, ah, immersive projectiles, non-detection of enemies. This is, uh, bandits and so on. They won't dodge, um, projectiles, arrows. I might need to just change that one, really. Real rain. Uh, alternate start is installed. Huh. Become a bard. Custom difficulty. Oh no. What's that for? Uh, 
Custom difficulty UI for Skyrim MC. I, I, I don't remember that. I didn't know I had that running. <laughs> we stand by Travelers of Skyrim. That's not me. Oh, UI. User interface is not, it's nothing to do with um, Johanna Nihus. Uh, Python X Dilemma, Thor Greens, I think, probably. Oh, no, no, there we are. Thor Mel Leveler. And I got this one, which is a, a separate one for Sky Test, which is the animals. So let's try Thor Mob Leveler. Where's the then creation kit? Oh, I opened it again. Uh, that's Fallout 4 creation kit. Oh, I opened the Fallout 4 one yet. Yeah. Diddle. Instead of the Skyrim SE, where's this Skyrim SE one? I could be, can you see it? <laughs> Where are we? Skyrim SE, go on. You can do it. Oh, look, it's my wedding picture. Mm. Um. Shit. Why did I? Oh, that's why it. I've probably broken the mob now. There it is. So, I'll, but no, because it, it, no, well, it didn't, it wasn't, it wasn't, I didn't do it that way, I think. We'll soon find out. There, Ford Mob Leveler. It'll open all the master files as well. Just, um, yeah. No. So it's active file. Hmm. Now we wait again. Great, eh? Yeah. All the fun of modding. <laughs> um, but the trouble is, I don't know if the other one, uh, BSAI Dodge, whatever it's called, I don't know if that one edits the, um, uh, oh, I don't know if that one, oh, come on. I don't know if, <laughs> if that one. Ah, no, that, oh God. I'm loading all my mods on here now. Oh, flipping heck. I'm doing this, I'm messing this. It says E edit is, um, if I, I thought there was a, I select none. I want to select BS, what was it? I think it stands for bullshit, but <laughs> become a bard. No BS. <clears throat> I don't know which one of these to load, so I'll load them all. Probably all. And then wait. This is where you find, you use this to look for errors. Hello. We're off to uni in a bit. Oh, wow. You must be brainy. Here it is. Game setting. Ah, that's all right. He's, he's edited the AI, not the, not the thing. That's all right. That's good. And close that. I was just doing that. <laughs> hey, bye boom. This is going to take a while. Still, better to do it now. And I might even make the bandits even tougher than they are because they're not doing very well, are they? Some are. Some are. Some are fine. There's always a possibility. I think there's probably like a percentage chance that um, a certain one will spawn. So sometimes you'll get a normal bandit. Sometimes you'll get a super bandit. Um, depending upon your level and the roll of the dice. Well, I think I think I can increase the possibility that I'll get a tough one. So I think I've, I've probably already done that, but you know. By the way, if I open like if I open, um, let's see. 
Forward greens, what is that? Forex, I'm going to open that one because it might be in that one. I thought. Forward thingy home. Thought greens is supposed to be only. Um, Graphical, but I think it makes changes as well. So there it is, for greens, and it'll be for everything. So Skyrim update. Oh, not that one. There we go. There might be errors in that one. Has this opened? It has. So if I do that and I can't find it with that, and I go all again, it's all. Oh dear. Armor add on. Where's level leveled item? No, it's uh, leveled. Oops, not a magic level character. This is it, and it, and it. So, like, look, okay, bandit one magic. Uh, here we go, level character. You should be able to see what I've changed, actually. What have I changed? I haven't changed any of these, I think. No. Maybe I've changed the actor. Yes. There it is. Demo Bandit. There you go. DLC 2. That's another one. DLC 2. Let's, let's change it like that. Ah, what have I edited? Oh, all these look. Encounter Bandit Boss. I don't want the bosses. I don't care about the bosses. Encounter Bandit 05 Template Magic. Look. Let me see. Oh, this is the actual Bandit Plunderer. Look. What have I changed? Probably just change this level 19 to 77 because the normal bandit would like stop at about level 20 or something normally. So, but AI data confidence full hardy. You see, this this is what controls will they run away? Won't they run away? All right, so I need to make them all everything here that I've uh, modded. Um, I've got <laughs> it's gonna take a while, wouldn't it? I've got to go down through these and look for the ones I have changed and make sure that they won't run away. There's one, <clears throat> see, brave, foolhardy. Now you'll never run away. I can check with the AI package as well, though. AI data, AI package. This is default, so I'm not going to change that. AI data, right? He gets his from. Oh, blow me. What's this again? Oh, this is a template. Um. Oh my God. Oh, I remember. Use. So this is where that character is used. So he's got used in all these encounter bandits. So he's just a template. I don't need to change the template. I already have there, but it doesn't matter. Like a encounter bandit six template. Why? Why? Why is this one? What's it's getting its information out of something. Probably that. Oh well, don't matter. It's only a. It's it's, it's in kind of bend it six template. I don't know. What about this magic one? So maybe it's the melee one. That's I don't know. Uh, AI data. Look, brave. No, full hardy. Uh, I haven't. Had to change all of these then, because these 
are getting their information from that template. Yeah, so I'd edit that one. These template. This one's getting his information from. Maybe that's the problem. His information is coming from that one. ENC Bandit 00 template. ENC Bandit 00 template. Where's that then? ANC Bandit. There. There we go. They're getting in. That's one. He's getting his info. He's getting this. It's already on full hardy. Thought though. Hmm. Uh, I probably changed it there and I thought, well, that's it. That's that's it now. I don't need to change any of the rest. Okay, let's. I'm just going to go through all the ones I've changed and I will set them to full. I'll make sure they're on full hardy. That's how I'll do it. Uh, full hardy. I think uh, they are, aren't they? I just I missed one. Probably looked at this one just now. Full hardy. This one is full hardy. This one is full hardy. This one is full hardy. So it's also this, this is what he wears. Um, and you got like a level of bandit cuirass and all that. And I'll have a look at that later. I probably edited those. They should now include at higher levels, better armor, like, hello vampy. Better armor, like, um, uh, like ebony and things like that instead of just the normal stuff yeah but let's have a look at this stuff okay um this one full hardy this one <laughs> Full Hardy. This one. I might have missed the template or something as well, but I don't it took ages to go through and find all the these are the um, these are the, the files that define the NPC, what they look like, stuff like that. Everything. And this one is full hardy. See, look at this one. See, these will be different. These will say, see, they use the information from that. So those, that's the one I needed to edit. Yeah. And that's what I'm doing now. These are DLC too. These are, these are not even in Skyrim. These will be on Sol Solstheim, I think. That's all right. Doesn't matter. I want them all to be full hardy. Hardy. Come on. <clears throat> and it be brave. Go oh, hardy. So oh, hardy, they run in and they never run away. They attack and they never run away. Brave. That's a reaver plunderer. I don't know why I wouldn't. Why I would leave them on brave. Brave is you might make your your um, follower brave instead of foolhardy. 
because then they won't attack until you do. It's a bit like that. Reaver Marauders. Mm, brave, no, foolhardy. They run away when the difference between my level and their level is a certain amount. Um, so I need, actually, I need, I need to be checking that that as well goes up to, well, 77. So they'll be my level. They might be a little bit less than my level, actually. Hmm. Oh, wait, I didn't read. I'm not even looking. <laughs> I'm just double clicking and clicking on cancel. Um, all right. Oh, he's getting it from somewhere else, though. Oh, he's getting it from somewhere else, but I will have to edit his level uh, here. Yeah. So he's brave, foolhardy. Confidence average. He's getting this from that one. Let's just check. Edit. Look. You see, he's, he's got that one. Uh, that gets that from that one. That list is from that list. Um, that one is this one. And he is full hardy. So that is fine. This is how it works. You you start with hang on, I'll show you. Uh AI data. So if I edit that one, okay, I'll we'll get that one. Um that one, that one. There it is. So that is a bandit. That's a that's what they look like. That's what that's the NPC himself. Okay, he is in a list, yeah. And you can see this calculated from all levels, PC level calculate for each item in count. So this is the encounter. So this one, you get one and health hundred percent. You can have one of them. It will choose. So all it means is you'll get that you might get an imperial bandit a nord bandit a red guard bandit you get all kinds of bandits and if i click preview calculate result that sometimes you'll get that one sometimes you'll get that one and all that stuff so it chooses these and these are all from level one so right starting from the beginning if but if the default is the maximum level is 30 and i'm at 60 they'll always run away i mean they'll stand no chance will they um cancel that all right so that's that one bandit one melee one that and that gets its information from all this <laughs> yeah so look at level one you'll get that one see the level on the left so at level one you'll always get that one at level four, level 25 you'll get you might get number six anything between number one this one and this one, Bandit 1 and Bandit 6. So for preview, this time I got Bandit 1. Do it again, Bandit 1. Do it again. Oh, hang on. Oh, I say, right, okay, I'm going to do that. And then I'm getting melee 1. Right, that time I'm getting a, um, a counter Bandit 1, melee 1, Nord M. North mail. This time I'm getting da da da. Bandit one, melee one, one handed, and Nord mail. Now I'm getting red guard. Yeah. So I could get any one of these. <laughs> could generate different one every time. So if when it generates is max level ten, which happens, you get one at max level ten. Um, that one will always run away. That's why I've got bandits running away. Because they're a lower level than me. But they'll always be a lower level than me. Um, but um, I think. No, and my level or below. Yeah. 
So it'll always be my level or a bit less, a few levels, two or three levels, something like that. They might be. But their, their max level is 50. So I'm like 62. They're going to they're gonna keep running away from me. And it just goes back. The list gets like random lists. And you just get whatever. Uh, but then, so then this one probably gets his information from a, a list. There, actor base. So then that's, that I would have edited that one in here somewhere. So you haven't got to edit all of them. That's the point. And you got to make sure that all the ones in the, in the list have max level there. I think I set them all to 77 though. It's probably 70, yeah, set them all, I set them all to 77, I don't know why. It was probably quick to type it. Hey, I pack it, where's it gone? It's gone, uh, there we go, four hard, he, he's fine. Um, this one, the magic one, this one is four hardy. I don't know who was running, somebody was running away, I missed, some, missed somebody, didn't I? Actually, more than one. They were running away and they were saying, Don't hit me, don't hit me. Stupid. Full hardy. Full hardy. Full hardy. Let's check one of these, look. Uh, Missal Khajiit. Because I haven't edited that one. So let's just have a look at that. How does that one work? That one. And it's level. Is. Yeah. Level is taken from. This. So nice. I go back to these. I'm not sure how far I got. <laughs> oh. Fair for neck. Right. Uh, AI. Full hardy. He won't run away. Uh, full hardy. Full hardy. I think he won't run away. There is something else I can look at. I can look at the general AI. Like this. These. He doesn't use one. He's just got AI data. Which is that, so CS Human Melee 3, so I can have a look at that if I want. And, uh, maybe that says run away, I don't think so. I don't think it works that way. Uh, full hardy. I think this will be enough, just make it full hardy. Uh, full hardy. Oh, Hardy. Full oh, Hardy. There's another one. There's loads of them. I didn't think it'd be this man. Hello! Airman. Let me just get this right. Airman. Oh no, Airman? Eric's. That's uh, breath. Breathe? You telling me to breathe? Yeah. If you're telling me to breathe, no, not doing that. Not Sunday. I only breathe on Sunday. Um. <sighs> if I set, where is it? Aggression to frenzied. They'll just attack everybody. There's a, a mod. Somewhere, I, don't, I suppose you can still get it, and you can that you can put it's a, a follower, and if you take him into White Run, he just kills everybody. <laughs> He's mad. He's like a crazy person. I don't know how else to call it, but yeah. So he won't wait for frenzy. So he won't wait for me to attack that that follower won't wait for me to attack if he sees an enemy he 
you could go you go mad um something like that full hardy oh missed one full hardy <sighs> Oh, Hardy. So, Hardy. See, editing AI. See how long? I mean, take hours and you do this, and then you think, hmm, I think I'll like. I, what about the, um, you know, what about the, the what do they call trolls or bear? What about the bears? They always run away. Let's change the bears. <laughs> yeah, we'll change the flipping bears. Oh, wait a minute. It didn't need to look at that one. Oh, no, it was more. Um, hmm. Full hardy. Full hardy. I could change the bears, but I don't want to. I'd have to go into a different. There's a different mod for that one. The other mod, because it, I want to avoid conflicts with another mod. So you have to edit them and do it. Do it's like a. Sometimes you'll get a patch for a mod to, to uh, maintain compatibility, or somebody will say this mod is not compatible with. So if I've got another another mod. That edits bears. Um, but I've got another mod that edits bears. Keep telling me I'm low on storage space. I'm not at all. I don't know. Anyway, I'm not. Re look, manage storage. Watch. What? Seventeen megabytes free on my SSD. Oh, it's my desktop. I've downloaded loads of um, mods and things. All right, I'll I'll look at that in a minute then. Um, that's Windows. My C drive is Windows. So my desktop. I'll have to have a look. I downloaded various things for um, um, what's it called? I can't remember. Stalker. Loads and loads of mods. Like, I don't know, it's got to be like 50 or 60 gigabytes or something stupid like that. And that's why it's... Well, I didn't don't be more than that. But set my documents folder to the D drive and all my games are installed on the D drive and things like that. The D drive is the big one. The Windows one is just a smaller drive, and it, all it has is Windows. It's an SSD. Um, then, if I want to reinstall onto the PC, what? Wow. Okay, if I want to, let's save it because. That's normal. <laughs> Big game. Right. Yeah, so documents is set to the D drive by default. So if it says, if anything like a game says save to the, oh, it's crashed. Shit. This one I was looking at. It, it will conflict always is this one is supposed to it, it, it conflicts with the update it just this like it's changing the the lighting uh for example so it changes um red from 45 to 46. <laughs> it's not a lot it's not a lot but it, it's this stuff it like makes that some things look grayer um some of the colors look better um 
the weather and sky looks different and what does this one do let's have a look down here i don't know can't remember so long ago i did it um I don't know, I can't see very much. It doesn't, these look the same to me. Oh, I think what it was, um, the... Um, oh, I don't know. Here we are. So, in the original Skyrim, red, green and blue was 48, 72 and 80. In mine, 64... No, and then it went to 64, 96, 106. Now it's 66, 103, 115. It just makes it more bright, a bit brighter, I think. Anyway. <sighs> Flipping it. I'm going to do it. I've started now. Oh, shall I make this? this um, look, it's all these. Let's have a look. How big are these? How big is this? <clears throat> yeah, 55 gigabytes. That'll keep the thing happy. This is all on the C drive. I, I shouldn't be doing it like this. So we just, I'll just move that into, I'll make sure I'm doing this right. D, <laughs> D document. No, I'll just put it in D. Um, I'll just make a new folder. I call it uh, stalker stuff to look at. Move it. It's going to take ages, isn't it? 55 gigabytes. I'm surprised Windows was still working. It was like, God, there's, oh, oh, five minutes. Can I still edit? I suppose I can. Look, I'll tell you what, I'm going to be sitting here for ages and all I'm going to be doing is this. So if it really, and maybe another half an hour, and all I'm going to be doing is editing uh, um, characters, whatever parts of Skyrim. So if it like if you're waiting because you think it's going to be very soon, um, it's not going to be so. <laughs> be ages before I'm finished. So just if you if you feel like you want to go away, go away. I don't I'm not offended or anything like that. But if you're sitting there waiting for a word wall. You might have to wait for a while. Um, that's all. Is that active? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to make a coffee as well. All right, how are you doing? Error message, lovely. 
Yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> yeah, vampy for popping back. This is, I know it's really boring, but some people actually like watching this rubbish. <laughs> I used to. I used to watch. Oh dear. Oh, we're nearly done. Excellent. Great. <clears throat> so I suppose everything with the word bandit in it again. Oh, great. Initializing references, of course. I forgot that. Um, how's, the, how's the C drive doing? 21 gigabytes free. It's only 232 gigabyte. It's very small. I thought it was 250, but anyway. It's only a small hard disk, but um, and then the other one's nearly f it's four terabytes. But uh, yeah. Yeah, so if I have to reinstall Windows, I don't lose, and my data will still be there. Um, so would all the programs, so it'd be a mess, but I wouldn't lose my photographs, my game, save things, things like that. See so if I go, all this quick access stuff, so if I look at documents, that, properties, it's, uh, oh, it's on the C drive, that one. Okay, I've got two. <laughs> That's the other one. And this one is on the D drive, look. Okay, so all the save games and most of my stuff is there. I don't know what's, what's on here. Um, uh, it's some games. Look, uh, it's some games where the save game goes, it keeps putting it on the C drive, like it or not. What's the... I should let's check the size of that actually. Sixteen gigabytes is tiny. How about this one then. <laughs> Have a laugh. Hmm. It's the oh a lot. I don't know. Uh... Well, for a start, D drive's got all this stuff on it now. Can't believe like this. Where's it gone? This. I can't believe I look. Items remaining, 42 gigabytes. How stupid was I? I knew it was a lot. Yeah. It's multiple copies of um, Stalker. And it's done. Just click there for a minute so don't get loads of stuff and it uh nothing oh sorry actor Got all these to check um not each one but, but a lot of them i want to look at uh there's some in here uh some in here no these are they're all included aren't they Leveled characters, there'll be some in here, I'm sure. Actors, probably. No, okay, maybe not. Uh, leveled lists, leveled item. Let's see. Oh, no. Um.
because yeah, they put some of them in funny places. Book, ingredient key, low. This is like loot and, and things like that, not leveled item, bandit, boss, mace. I was sure I'd change those. Hmm. And we could be looking at a conflict. <sighs> Full hardy. I think every time I change one, I'll save. Yeah. I forgot. Full hardy. If I have to change, I might have done them all. I don't think I have, but I might have. No, I haven't. I know I haven't. Full hardy. <laughs> Should I be checking stats as well? I don't think so. And if I missed one, it would only be like max level 77. It wouldn't be all of them. Full hardy. Was It wasn't the damage, it was the running away that bothered me yesterday. More than anything, full hardy. But like the lower level ones, they won't wear. Um, ebony armor. You won't get a level one car uh, bandit wearing ebony armor. That's not hard to, to make to to, um, to guard against. <clears throat> Full hardy. Oh, hardy. I probably went through all of these. Uh, full hardy. Oh, I thought if you got, I forgot if you do a band, uh, a thing, you've got to generate, uh, faces for them all, or they'll come out looking black faces with black faces. So I'll have to do that as well. Oh, cool. Uh, ah, no. See, that was wrong. Um, <laughs> brave. Oh, Hardy. This is Reavers. Bandit boss. Oh, Hardy. Right, I've changed something. I'm on DLC 2 and Counter Bandit 6 boss. Yeah, they're missing the faces. They're missing the faces. So I'll have to go through the list after. Click on every one, highlight them all. The ones that have got a star on them, the ones I've edited. And, um, and that's it. Oh, come on. I oh, know I'm not keeping um I'm not keeping backups but this is so basic and I can just I don't have to keep it what's happening if it crashes again I'm just going to stop and play the game cuz I'm a little bit fed up for doing this already I can't actually remember how to generate face data, faces, face graphics, face meshes, all that stuff. Yeah, it's going to crash. It's just too long. It says not responding, but uh, no, it did it. My God. Did it? 
It's not there. That is not showing down here. Oh well. <laughs> Uh, let's double click that and see what happens. How funny. Oh, now it's showing up and it wasn't, it wasn't in the taskbar. Bloody thing. Modding is, mo is as buggy as it is playing. Skyrim is buggy. Oh, look at this. There's another one. I didn't do any of them, did I? I didn't do any of them. I changed something and I didn't, but I didn't change the, um, confidence. I probably just changed the levels thinking they won't run away. <laughs> Obviously that's not true. Alright, what else? There's one. Bandit Super Mortal. <sighs> Nearly you're getting there. Halfway look. <clears throat> Oh, Hardy. So it looks like Bethesda, maybe. If I didn't change it, then somebody did. I'll be Bethesda. Full Hardy. Why did they set some to run away and others not to? It's really silly. Oh, well. Very aggressive. I oh, know, not frenzied, is it? Think berserker, berserker. That's um, frenzied. <laughs> Maybe I should do that just for a laugh. Set a few of them to frenzied, fight each other. I think can't quite remember. It's something like that. Right, I do this group. And then I'll save again, I think. Maybe it's taking a long time because I'm on cut paste this is going on as well, isn't it? Shouldn't matter, but maybe it does. If you ever edit, I'll show you a tip. If you edit, like, oh shit, okay, hang on. This one has not been edited. If I double click it, to have a look at it, and I should click on OK, it, the game then thinks I've modified it, even if I don't change anything. So if you're closing something without editing it, always click Cancel. Otherwise, the model get too busy. Right, which is Encounter Bandit 2. Oh, God, it goes up to four or five. That's better. Right, here's number three. Still two. Oh, and three. Uh, four hardy. Foolhardy. Nice. Do I want them to have better armor or not? That's the thing, isn't it? Do I really care? Not really. Mm. Oh, no, I remember who it was. I changed the leveled list of my mercenaries. My mercenary mod, not somebody else's. I don't usually mod, edit somebody else's mod unless there's something wrong with it. 
I don't think I think it's better not to because they probably sat and looked at it and thought this will work that will work and if you change something you can mess it all up that's what would happen with my complete smithing mod Hmm. Go hardy. Go hardy. Go hardy. Mostly all right, aren't they? It's only a few. Let's band it three. The difference between them, I don't know. These are all bandit bosses, but um, there are probably like um, one will use um, more like magic one. He might use a different set of spells because he's um, like, it might have a, 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 this one, yeah, it's a different spell list and different perks. And they'll be chosen. In that way the AI might be different so they might be they might attack slightly differently so that all the bandits aren't the same that's the point so we'll have a look AI data full hardy cancel I'm not changing it I know I'll make it I know I've got it something changed if it says creation kit 64 bit and all that and then there's a little asterisk that means I've changed something It has happened before that I've done a lot of stuff and then I've noticed, no, I haven't, I thought I hadn't done anything. I've made no changes. And then I noticed there's a star in the title at the top. And I'll think, oh bugger, I did, I changed something. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh... Oh, honey. Hmm. All right. So then inventory is level item, L item, boss, bandit, boss, shield, bandit, bandit. So it's all bandits. Okay. And he gets. Um, a dagger is specified in his character so I could change the dagger so that uh, this bandit boss number four always has a um, ebony dagger or something else yeah or his dagger but but um, yeah I mean, it doesn't matter too much if I don't change change his, his dagger because <laughs> he'll have he'll have like he's two handed so he'll have um something else as well. It's these things, so I won't I can't open them right now. But these uh, thing one will be his his um his weapon. Uh, but then up here he's wearing this is his armor, so it's, it's also selected from another list. Crazy. Anyway, full uh, one. And then if you edit leveled lists, as they're called, you've got to be careful you don't edit one that's used by a level 10 bandit, because that, that, that one, then you might find yourself at level 10 coming up against somebody uh, equipped with ebony armor, and you don't want that. That would be a shame. It doesn't matter very much, because my, my character's now level 62, and this mod is made for her, but you know, I don't know. Maybe one day I'll want to give it to someone else. And I don't want to have to change it again before, you know. Yeah. <sighs> no, they all seem to be pretty good anyway. Well, I've run them before. I think, I, I think look, we, we're getting there. It's, it only really goes up to five, so. I'll oh, run number five. Great.
Maybe it's Bandit 1 they've, they've set to Brave instead of Foolhardy by default. So that, yeah. But they have to, they have to lose our health anyway. Things like that. I don't know how it decides who does what. But who, when they run away, there's probably a setting somewhere that you say only run away. It says like at 10% health. And I could probably change that for everybody. So it's a eight, a only run away at 1% health and then nobody will run away, will they? I don't know. Might have a look in a minute for fun. Might be the last one. Nope, won't be. There you go. Oh, just a few more. Not a lot. Mm, maybe eight. Eight or ten. Brave. Ah, ha, ha, ha. We can't have anybody running away. It's such a pain in the ass, isn't it? When a bandit you're fighting runs away. And you've got to run after him. Oh, my goodness. Dear, oh, dear. Brave, look. He would run away. Oh, it goes up to six, not five. Okay, I'm starting six. So we save. Uh oh, egg timer. Oh, this is about to complete. Excellent. I'll check it afterwards. Check the hard disk, make sure it's okay. Just leave it like that. Five seconds. Uh, PC crash. Gum. Good doom. Uh, really silly name, wasn't it? Oh, he's done. Well, let's finish doing this first. Oh, Hardy. Full Hardy. Maybe I'll just change the bandit bosses so the bandit bosses have a chance of, of wearing um ebony armor or something like that so i could just change his his chest plate his breastplate or his shield just just do something cuz i don't want them to to everybody to be wearing ebony armor or the bandits it would look stupid but if they were to wear a best breastplate not about ebony but something Uh. Mm. Uh. Uh. Bandit Marauder Orc. Orc wouldn't run away out of everybody. That shouldn't be like that. All right. There's another one. <laughs> oh my goodness me. Brave. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. Brave. That would be the archer. There you go. Nobody will run away. That's that's a good start. No. Leveled. Where is it? Class faction. Packages? No. Items? Here we are. 
that DLC to Bandit Armor at all. So if I double click that, so then you've got if I, uh, random look Armor Bandit, Armor Hide. Armor Bandit, Armor Bandit. So it keeps generating Armor Bandit stuff and Armor Hide stuff. Kuras. Oh, that's a bit, that was different that time. Yeah, it's, it's, it's generating really rubbish stuff. Um, I'm all Bandit Armor Boss, look. This is for the DLC too, so uh, it doesn't really matter very much right now. But like, so uh, we've got there's a chance then of somebody wearing bone mold armor, bone mold stuff. Chitin Nordic at level twenty five. Nordic, Nordic heavy, star rim, star rim, Nordic heavy. That's all right. Uh, but that's not the that's the DLC two one. So the original Skyrim seems to have a bit of a a bit of a crap thing. So at level one, they can all have. Um, all right, it's going to choose from another. Hmm. Um, okay. Oh, this loot. I'm looking at loot, idiot. There we go. Bandit battle axe. Let's see. There we are. So he could at he could actually at level twenty two could have an elven one. And I could add another another one there for level um fifty ebony or something like that, but I think that's okay. Steel battle axe. See if I put level twenty two, somebody at level twenty two, it would give him steel Iron, 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 steel, iron, really? Steel, dear me. Um, calculate from all levels, less than or equal to PC, my level. Calculate for each item in count. I don't know what that means but if if somebody's oh if somebody's at level 22 so if I had a level I'm level 62 so if I was a level 62 character iron really steel steel iron really oh preview oh god preview level that's why so if he's level 62 then he could still have an iron battle axe uh dwarven iron orcish iron iron orcish iron so i could add hmm global what Hmm. Um, so yeah, I could. Can I add another one? How do you add another one? New. Hang on. I think I already just edited it. Yeah, I did. <laughs> so if I add new. And that would be at level 50, say. About 50 for, oh, and then Ebony. Ebony Battle Axe, where's that? Ebony Battle Axe. So now I will calculate the preview. We'll have 49 steel, elven, iron, Orcish. So it's different. It might have different things. Now, if it's at level sixty-two, no, not ninety-six. Sixty-two. 
still I I'm still Elven Dwarven Orcish let's do preview pack 10 it'd be easier uh hmm he's got ebony 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 yeah there's there's so if you had a group of um 10 you, one of them would have an ebony battle axe it's not a very <laughs> high chance but i think it's worth having now boots, I like boots being, we could have like, look, these are all armor bandit, armor scaled boots, scaled armor. That's the best you'll get. No, armor bandit boots. Oh, bandit, oh I see, that's actual boots. Okay, let's give, let's do bandit boss. Let's do do the weapons look. I'll have to. I think I've. It already says ebony at th level thirty six. He could be, could have ebony. So that's the bandit boss and like the bandit boss cuirass, the chest plate. What's this going to be? Steel. Best you'll get is steel. Hmm. I could add one. Well, well, he's a bandit boss. We could give him Nordic. New. At level 50. So at level 50, you can have armor. Oh, blimey, Nordic's not called Nordic, it's called something else. Armor, Dwarven, Ebony, Elven, Farmer, Glass. you got to be careful because you could end up with them wearing something really silly. Or breaking the game because it's like something used for cosmetic or, or something like that. So I've got to be a bit careful. Nightingale. Orcish, maybe. If I can't find steel, storm cloak. Oh, what am I looking for? Cuirass, okay. Whatever. Thieves Guild. No, you don't think so. Daedric? Ooh. Don't know what the recipes are. I don't even know what they are. Oh, blimey, look. I'm going to be here forever. Let's put that one up there like that or there and um, look for what do I want I want to find um, Nordic armor hmm. pretty sure it's not called that so armor oh, look it's called no it's just not DLC 2 is it Armor Nordic. All right, so it comes under the name DLC two. So look for. Actually, we just type DLC. DLC two, armor, armor Nordic. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Armor. Hunter. Oh, DLC one, nice. So the DLC two armor no armor Nordic Not as easy as you might think, is it? I don't want to give them enchanted stuff, right? I guess it starts getting too complicated. Enchanted armor. Armor oh come on. Actually, oh yeah, armor um, chitin Nordic. Yes, two there. So at level fifty, he has a chance of having Nordic armor. Brilliant. 
again, banned it. So they've got their own stuff as well. Nightmare, isn't it? We will be leveled. Leveled list, level character, leveled item, bandit. There it is. Uh, bandit boss great sword. Let's give him the chance of having an ebony great sword. Steel level thirty. Could yeah, I've already done that. I think or somebody else. Uh, mace. Yeah, he can. They can have ebony weapons. Well, I think that's a little bit better. No, I need to so Skyrim. Let's see modding uh, creation kit face gen. Oh. Uh, regenerating fa there it is. Um, I was going to put in mine. You were still encounter black faced bugs and NPCs. Uh, this has just got how to do it, not this isn't actually. Oh, here we go. All right, setting up really great emissions as a patch. Cut and paste. No, 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 that's, that's, not, that's not right. Oh, there we go. Face gen to generation tutorial. Uh, da, da, da. Face gen requirements. You'll need to make the distinction between an NPC replacer and an NPC addition mod. Uh, that's me. Yeah, once you've delivered your mod, just the mod. Click the plus next to it, then check in the drop down list for any non player character actor once loaded. This will make, if an NPC has a background color on its record, oh god, this has come on. Uh, there's there's some clicks. That's all you got to do. Where's the bloody clicks? It's like control click or something like that. Um, where fixing the gray face bug? That might be it. Skyrim modding. First, you need to export the f face gen data for each NPC. Select the NPC in the creation kit, press Ctrl plus F4. That's it. If you have multiple NPCs, you can do them all at the same time. Ah, uh, that's what I wanted to know. Actor. <sighs> right, so all I've got to do is select them all. And then they, they won't have a black face. Because you can... I have this trouble with follower because with PlayStation 4, you cannot upload textures and this will generate textures so um if if i uploaded a follower i'd have to do this to generate so she wouldn't have a black face but i could not upload the textures to playstation as a playstation mod so i've created followers but they've got black faces the reason being this um this 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 thing i didn't think this would take i thought this would take like half an hour <laughs> so i apologize in advance um It's just control click. Oh, bugger, what happened then? Oh. Actually, some of these are, um... no, 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 they all need to be done, I think. I think so. And then you've, if you had this in um, normal Skyrim and you did want to post upload the textures and the and the meshes as well, you would have to um, hang on. 
you have to package them. So you have to make, so look, I've highly, I've highlighted all the ones I've modded. So control F4, do I want, yes, that's it. Just wait for a minute. Right, so I think the, now the bandit boss can have some better armor maybe. And I think the other ones could, so, and they won't run away, done. I'll save it once more. Do I want to change another mod then? Ah, <laughs> uh, for the next. Do you know, if I were to do this for um, complete smithing, if I sat, let's say two weeks, seven days a week, eight to 10 hours a day, I don't think I would finish it after two weeks of that. It, it takes so long, it's amazing. Which is why complete smithing isn't up to date. Well, it, it is now, but not the one on the internet because it's so it takes it's so hard to do. Um, I think that's it. I've removed. Yeah, that's it. I've removed. Um, so she won't. She's not going to keep summoning the, the fire thing. Uh, I will from time to time um instead yeah yeah how long is that hour and a half i'm gonna i'm gonna interrupt the stream for 20 minutes and then i'd be able to separate this from the skyrim chapter six and i think that's the best thing to do because Otherwise, I mean, nobody wants to sit and stare for an hour and a half. That's not part of a let's play. So, um, is it? So I'll, I'll stop for like 20 minutes, go and have a coffee, come back, play the game. We'll be looking for word walls. There might be one Daedric artifact to get as well. I'll have to look that up. 